Princess Eugenie celebrated her fifth wedding anniversary with Jack Brooksbank by sharing a heartwarming family portrait and a beautifully edited wedding video on her Instagram account. The granddaughter of the late Queen Elizabeth Theo took to social media to commemorate this special occasion with her followers. In the captivating video, which had never been publicly seen before, the 33-year-old princess shared intimate moments from her wedding day, which took place at St. George's Chapel in Windsor on October 12, 2018. The video also featured a recent candid family portrait, the first time the family of four had been publicly photographed together. This touching family snapshot depicted Princess Eugenie, daughter of Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson, with her husband Jack Brooksbank and their two children, two-year-old son August and four-month-old son Ernest, posing on a picturesque beach. The couple radiated happiness in the photograph, with young August playfully holding up his little hands filled with pebbles, while baby Ernest was wrapped snugly in a towel, cradled by his loving mother. Eugenie captioned the video with a simple yet heartfelt message, saying five years ago today, and set the footage to the soulful song, You've Got the Love, by Florence and the Machine. The video began with a countdown from five, leading viewers through various highlights of her wedding day. Viewers were treated to glimpses of Street George's Chapel, the fluttering royal standard, the Rolls Royce that transported the bride and her father, and the horse-drawn carriage that carried Eugenie and Jack after the ceremony. The video also showcased Eugenie's exquisite Peter Pilata wedding dress displayed on a mannequin, and the moment the stunning Greville Emerald Kokoschnik Tiara was placed atop her head before leaving for the church. The video didn't just focus on the bride, it also gave viewers a peek into Jack's preparations for the momentous day, showing him raising a glass of champagne with friends, having a baftonier pinned to his jacket, and posing for photographs. The video beautifully documented the wedding ceremony at Street George's Chapel, capturing Jack's radiant smile as he watched his bride make her way down the aisle, accompanied by her father, Prince Andrew. The Duchess of York and Princess Beatrice were also featured, their eyes filled with adoration from their seats. Up close, Eugenie's distinctive pink engagement ring was showcased, and the newlyweds were seen exiting the chapel with their page boys and flower girls, including Prince George and Princess Charlotte. A special moment in the video captured Eugenie and Jack sharing their first kiss as a married couple on the church steps, followed by a series of photographs portraying various wedding moments, from the couple's joyful dance at their wedding reception at Royal Lodge to a formal portrait and a sweet selfie. The video concluded with the first public image of Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank as a family of four with their sons, creating a heartwarming finale to the celebration of their fifth wedding anniversary. Princess Eugenie has remained one of the select members of the royal family who actively engage with the public through Instagram, using the platform to mark significant milestones. In June, she joyfully announced the birth of her son, Ernest George Ronnie, and in August, she celebrated her sister Beatrice's birthday by sharing cherished family photographs. Reflecting on her wedding day, Princess Eugenie looked absolutely stunning in her long-sleeved open-back gown, adorned with folded shoulders and a voluminous train, designed by the talented London duo Peter Pilato and Christopher de Vos. The fabric of the dress featured embroidered symbols that held deep meaning for Eugenie, such as the thistle representing her family's Scottish heritage, a shamrock symbolizing her maternal family's connection to Ireland, and the York Rose. Eugenie's gown was notable for its low back, which proudly displayed the scar from the surgery she underwent at the age of 12 to correct her scoliosis, a curvature of the spine. She has since been actively involved in raising awareness about this condition. The bride's bouquet, meticulously crafted by Patress Van Helden Oix, featured a delicate arrangement of lilies of the valley, Stephanotis pips, baby blue thistles, white spray roses, and trailing ivy, further adding to the elegance of her ensemble. Eugenie adorned herself with the Greville Emerald Kokoschnik Terra, a beautiful heirloom inherited by the late Queen Mother in 1942. Made of brilliant and rose-cut diamonds pavaset in platinum, the tara featured six emeralds on either side. She also wore matching diamond and emerald drop earrings, 
a thoughtful wedding gift from her loving husband. On her wedding day, Princess Eugenie, accompanied by her father Prince Andrew, arrived at the chapel in a 1977 Rolls-Royce Phantom VI, the same car that Kate Middleton used for her own nuptials. The bridal party included her older sister Beatrice, who served as her maid of honor, and a charming group of flower girls, including Princess Charlotte, Savannah Phillips, Ayla Phillips, and Mia Tyndall, along with Prince George as a pageboy. Eugenie styled her bridal party in navy and ivory, each flower girl and pageboy adorned with a sash featuring a green floral print. The wedding day was truly a moment of grace, elegance, and love for Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank and their fifth anniversary celebration through this video was a touching reminder of the joy and happiness that marked the beginning of their journey as a married couple and now as a family of four. Among the 800 guests in attendance at the wedding of Princess Eugenie and Jack Brooksbank were some notable figures, including Sarah Ferguson, the mother of the bride, Queen Elizabeth Yu, and Prince Philip, as well as several celebrity friends of the couple. It was a grand and joyous occasion, filled with traditional elements and personal touches. Surrounded by their loved ones, the couple exchanged traditional vows. Notably, Eugenie chose to omit the part about obeying her husband, a decision shared with Princess Diana, Kate Middleton, and Meghan Markle at their respective weddings. This choice symbolized a shift towards more modern and equal partnerships in marriage. During the ring exchange, Jack placed a Welsh gold wedding ring on Eugenie's finger, a gift from Queen Elizabeth II. This gesture held significant historical value, as Welsh gold had been used in royal wedding rings since the Queen Mother's wedding in 1923. Interestingly, Jack opted not to wear a wedding band, following the example set by Prince William. The bride beamed with happiness throughout the hour-long service held in the spectacular setting of Windsor Castle. However, Jack appeared to be overwhelmed with emotion, which was evident to lip readers who suggested he had whispered to Eugenie, you look perfect as she approached the altar. Eugenie, in a light-hearted moment, had reportedly joked, aren't you going to hold my hand, to calm his nerves. Sarah Ferguson, the Duchess of York and the bride's proud mother, sat beside her eldest daughter Beatrice during the ceremony. She appeared tearful as she witnessed her youngest daughter's marriage. Following the ceremony, there was a brief carriage procession around Windsor to greet well-wishers before the couple returned to Windsor Castle for a lunch hosted by the Queen. In the evening, Prince Andrew hosted a black-tie reception at the Royal Lodge. Guests were treated to a gourmet pizza truck and margaritas, adding a modern and informal touch to the celebration. The couple arrived at the reception in a rare DB10 Aston Martin, one of the eight made for the 2015 James Bond movie Spectre, starring Daniel Craig. Eugenie made a wardrobe change, donning a second champagne-colored silk gown designed by Zach Posen for the evening festivities. The dress featured a sweeping cape, long sleeves, and pleated fabric, and it was inspired by the White Rose of York, with an embroidered white rose on both the shoulder and back to hold the cape detail together. She accessorized with Queen Victoria's wee ear brooches, on loan from Queen Elizabeth II, part of a trio commissioned by William I.V. in 1830 for Queen Adelaide. The centerpiece of the reception was the five-tier wedding cake, created by London-based baker Sophie Cabot. This culinary masterpiece required approximately 400 eggs, at least 53 packs of unsalted butter, 15 kilograms of organic self-raising flour, and 20 kilograms of sugar to make. During a series of speeches, the Duke of York broke with royal tradition by giving his new son-in-law a hug in front of the Queen, symbolizing the warmth and closeness of the royal family. Jack's speech was filled with love and devotion to Eugenie, expressing how she lights up his life and makes him feel complete. The wedding and the two parties were privately funded by the bride's family, including the expenses for flowers, entertainment, and the dresses. However, it is estimated that the security measures for the event cost taxpayers approximately £2 million, highlighting the significant logistical and security considerations that come with a royal wedding. Dear friend, if you like everything new about the royal family and don't want to miss all the novelties, subscribe to our channel and like it. By doing so, you take part in our development. We work for you.